um, with trash reporter, I think our, our uh, target was to ensure that we reduce the reaction time from when the end customer has an issue with the application to the time when the app dev team presents a solution to that problem. Uh, so that whole process of identifying the problem and figuring out the root cause of it uh, and then reacting to it was our target to uh, bring the time down. Uh, Actually, we had, uh, I think, a very good challenge because uh, we released an early access version with two mobile apps customers and uh, within three months we had more than 10 uh, mobile offerings that had onboarded. So we had a very healthy problem of scale because uh, we were still building the service and the app and we had great adoption so we had to cater to new customer requests, support existing customers, still continue development and uh, be able to scale to all these uh, new uh, you know, customer requests. So this time what we did is we took a deep breath first of all. We then tried to hit every target, every arrow that was being shot at us. We waited a little while, we gathered information across teams to get that generic view about all the differences that these teams might have. And then we attended to that problem saying, okay, this is a generic difference that we have across teams and we tried to solve for that. Uh, and the second thing was we were very close to our customers. Yeah, I would say one key learning is that uh, the mobile offering teams are really hungry for data. Any real-time access to usage data of the features or the application uh, is really what they're looking for. And uh, you know, Crash gave them that. The reporting gave them you know, real access, you know, data that they could use and actually improve their product. And I uh, our next steps is to make this even better. Uh, so now we have solved the problem of the developers who can really get access to the crash and find the problem. Uh, next stage is to solve for the end customer uh, to basically help close the loop so that the customer gets to know that his problem has been solved. Our ultimate goal is to not, is to envisage a crash that will happen in the future and stop it before it happens. For us, crash is a lagging indicator. We react after it happens. If we are able to get enough data to figure out, you know, X devices crashes always because of this scenario and we present it to a new app which is trying to onboard, maybe we'll be able to create a situation where we have stopped a crash from happening before it actually happened, right? So that's that's the ultimate goal. Really good. <laughs> I, th I think over, overall, right, you know, I consider myself to be a representative of the larger team. Uh, we, we were like we, we have three people who stood out there, uh, but there are there are a lot of other people who really helped build the product. Uh, we got ideas from a lot of set of people. Uh, there were many who inspired us. Uh, there are many people who stayed back, worked late nights to make this product a success. Uh, this is I mean the award I mean our names are showing up out there, but it is representative of all the other people who helped us uh, getting it out there uh, and not discounting the customers who actually trusted and onboarded onto us. If they were not there, this product wouldn't have gone Yeah, I think there. so. We have some really good first customers, TextWeb, Mint, right, and uh, APD Tom, uh, who partnered with us and helped us build the uh, right product. So I think we should also thank them. Yes. Mm -hmm.